CS108 is an introduction to application programming. And what we do is, in a single semester, we take students with no background in programming and teach them Python, HTML, and databases, and then put these ingredients together to be able to create a data-driven web application like Facebook. For about seven years, I taught this class in a traditional lecture-style room. And I was always teaching by example. But what I discovered is that it could take 45 minutes to do a five-minute example. You know, professor, I missed something. Can you go back? And then students would be working on their own to complete the homework assignments. And a lot of them would really do the heaviest thinking when they were working on the problem sets and the homeworks. By doing a flipped classroom, students are preparing the examples before they come to class and using classroom time to work on the assignments. The in-class assignments range from very simple text input and output and some calculations, all the way up to manipulating databases and developing web applications. When I have them working on the harder assignments, that they're not getting stuck on the simple things that students got stuck on previous semesters. And that's mainly because they've done so much more programming. In previous semesters, in the traditional classroom, students might have done about 10 homework assignments on a final project. Here we are, two-thirds of the way through the semester. They're doing assignment 20 today out of 25, and then a final project. So the total amount of output the students are doing is much higher, and I think that's contributing to their learning. I think one of the most rewarding things as a teacher is seeing the students actually work on the assignment and struggle with it and then get it. And that's something that I didn't see very much when I was just delivering examples from the front of the room because students would be going off on their own to work on their homework assignments. Now that I'm having students work on the assignments in the class, I see their struggles and I hear them exclaim, yay, when it works, and that's, that's a great feeling. I can see the evidence of learning and I can hear the excitement when they get it.